I'm Gary Yordahl. I'm Kate Yordahl. And uh, we are the founders of Photo Central. Um, we're the directors of Photo Central also. And Wildlife Beyond Borders is one of the exhibitions at Photo Central that we're really excited about. Wildlife Beyond Borders is 11 artists and has a really amazing array of different both animals and conservation concerns. It's one of the best wildlife photography exhibits I've seen and some of the best photography I've seen. And it's all in one place and it's all different. It's ocean, it's land, it's Arctic, it's Africa. Uh, so I think it, it <laughs> it's really an amazing exhibit. And to think that some of these photographs are the last photographs you're going to see of those animals is really sad. When they look at an image, it's not about the composition of the image, it's not about the technical aspect, it's about the, the sight of the, the animal that basically look at you and says, do something for me so that future generation and your kids can see me in the a, in a wild. We were just really trying to show how these animals relate to each other and how they relate to us and how important it is. So I think, you know, it's one effort, but it could spread, and I hope it does. We all have an obligation to understand the world we live in and to do what we can to preserve that world. It's easy to forget that in our day-to-day lives. One of the messages of Wildlife Beyond Borders is to try to bring that understanding to people and to have them reflect, if only for a short time, on the fact that the world is much bigger, much more diverse than the ones that we encounter in our daily activities. I think with this uh, show, there's a quote by Jane Goodall that really rings true. The greatest danger to our future is apathy. And I think with knowledge comes worth. And if we bring our children to shows like this and show them the value in saving environments and animals and things, that our future will be more conservation-minded. The first thing to do is um, get out in nature and go to the ocean, put your feet in the water, just get more familiar with it, get comfortable with it, and at that point you're going to care more about it and you're going to do things like pick up plastic off the beach or you know write to your representative. There's, there's just so much that needs doing and the first step really is to just get out there and get out of your house. <laughs>